we go, Marlo. Who wants to know? This guy. My name's Ripley. I'm with the company. You get a little more background of his character you in the book, too. Box already? You guys are keen, I'll give you that. <laughs> I'm here for personal reasons. My mother was on the Nostromo when it went missing 15 years ago. 15, y'all. You serious? Chips. Well. Chips. We never found her ship, Ripley. Just the recorder. But you sure as hell found something else. Oh, yeah. What happened out there? I need a way out of here, Ripley. Maybe we could make a deal. Just start talking. I want to know everything. Okay, so what I love about this game is even though there's very high pressure, high stakes, very tense uh, scenes, they give you scenes okay. like this and parts like this loose. and pretty much what we were doing a little while ago, walking around and doing Let's things, take it slow. where you don't have to worry to about the alien place. or the, the uh, androids or humans. You can just chill and play the game for a bit. Okay, enough already. Focus on what we're here for. I don't want any mistakes. Which, by the way, guys, <coughs> there's more parts that usually that give you that on other modes. You know, you get more in the easier than you do later. Scan for the signal using the tracking device. There you are. Foster Meeks, keep your eyes open. To this, these people that found the recording device, the flight recorder from the Nostromo, what they found, and basically what led up to um, the getting basically fucked. <laughs> I mean, it was already, you can already see from the lore and like the documents that we're reading that Sevastopol was already going out of business no matter what, but this pretty much made it to where you know all of them died. Yeah, the visibility is something more. God, this. It's so cool. You guys, like, I always thought seeing another planet would be so fucking awesome. Especially something like this. Look at that. It's so pretty. See if I can find a weak spot. Wait here. We have to find a route around it. You just gonna chill here? Okay. Gotta need a lift. Uh, Hi, over here. Give me a leg up. Yeah. Okay. I was like, I know it's right here somewhere that we have to do this. Oh, yeah, man. A path. Check it out. Yeah, it doesn't fall out. Okay. Then you wait some more. This, though, can you imagine walking up this in this kind of area where, like, if you fell, you'd pretty much be dead. Speaking of. Oh, okay. 
Stay put. I think I found something. Okay, we're going the right way. Cool. This way? Easy. There's a fissure in the rock. Stand back. Oh yeah. Avoid. Okay, here we go. Put the bomb. This is insane. I don't know if I would ever like do this because anything could happen. Like you don't know. Move back. I love little I love parts like this that you can just kind of chill and play that you don't have to worry so much about, you know, surviving every single moment as an alien. Let's get going. Follow me. Oh yeah, you know what? Um, but I remember I think one of them, the one who said don't do that to me again, I think that's his wife. You Hi, go up over here. here. Yep. Okay. Give me a leg up. I don't know how far we are into the game so far, uh, but this is a long game, guys. Keep that in mind. Nice. Like, I'm trying to... I'm thinking that even if we play um, Nightmare Mode right... I mean, Easy Mode to get the collectibles and everything, right after this, um, we'll do it little by little and play other games for a while. But, uh, yeah. This is a lot to this game. This game. Look at that, y'all. That's... If you guys saw the other movies, um, if you've seen, oh, what are they called? Prometheus? You see how this fits. Or like, you know, you've seen, you've seen it before. Alright guys, find the source of the signal. There! Okay, the signal's going up a little more. And as far as I know, there's nothing to collect here. We just, uh, we're just seeing what happened to them. How many of us are there? At least four. This guy. Okay, I don't know about y'all, but I would not want to be the one hanging back. <laughs> I would like to be the one squished and sandwiched in the middle. That way if something came, the guy behind me or the guy in front of me would get be the first to know and get hurt. <laughs> or not get hurt, but it would be, I like have a warning, you know, that would feel like it would give me better chances of survival than uh, being the first or last. But that's just my opinion. This is cool, by the way. This part right here. Like, the graphics were done so well. Enter the derelict. Or derelict. But yeah, the guy that's currently in the, uh, whatchamacallit? In the, uh, like, little gel cell that they have on the, on Sebastopol. Yeah, he's the one that did, uh, that experienced all this. We're actually, I think we're playing him. Come to think of it. There's only four of us, because I see this guy, but no one else following him. Oh, the music's cool. Look at this. Oh god. Oh god. Who are we going into? Look at this. The yacht. Explore the derelict. Something big. I mean, here's the thing. When you watch horror movies and you're like, you wouldn't go in there because of what could happen. You know what I think about too? Well, what are the chances that you're actually thinking that something like that is likely? You know, like they're running into things they never thought possible. So, usually, I feel like it's this when you go in those situations, you're thinking to yourself, you wouldn't, but then actually in them, you're thinking, oh, that stuff couldn't happen. You're just scared for nothing, you know? And then it happens and then you're fucked. But, oh yeah, generally how it goes. Look at Careful this. with what you touch. I don't want anything damaged. Weren't these like the creators or the makers? Yes. How old must this be? What is it? A cockpit? And make this a ship? Oh, ah, look at this. I think we found our payload. Hey, quiet. Oh, honey. Uh, you think yeah, we're going to wake you? Hey, sorry, pal. Can it. We're wasting time. Have a look around. Uh, it's a life form. Oh, yeah. It was a life form. Now it's our property. Salvage rights. Well, that's a little stink I claim before anyone else does. And Isadora is not prepared for something this big. Then we'll take what we can and come back. I think here, Have right? Have a look around and see what else is here. Mama, we found something. Some tracks. Tracks? It looks like something was dragged. Uh-oh. But that's not all. You're not going to like 
I can't run. What is it? Stuck to walking. Tracks lead here. Same name that's on the flight recorder. Australia. Someone said I could take it. Maybe they abandoned ship and landed here. Oh. I can see that. Shit. If they were here before us, why is there no record of this place? Well, if they're still alive, there goes our sound. That was a way to like. Let's stare, find out. But I guess not. I'll find the beacon and shut it off. Don't want anybody else finding this place. Foster, Heist, check out the cavern below. Locate the distress beacon. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. actually, I'm pretty sure it's right there. What is this? I've never seen anything like it. The distress signal's over here. I'll tell you that. And this guy will give me a boost. Guys, on Nightmare Mode, we actually got past those parts. Crazy. Just because, like, it was so difficult. I mean, look at my death count. We're not even that far into the game. When you really think about it. Okay. The beacon. Meeks, I found the beacon. I'm yep, gonna check it out. That. Oh, off the chart. Broadcasting. Nana, you have got to see this. It's amazing. On my way. Okay, return to the winch. I don't remember what she's looking at, but I mean you know none of this can be good. You know what they find here. Or what everybody finds on these ships. I kinda feel like watching this series right now, but I don't know. Oh, have you guys are looking forward to relaxing over the holidays? Like, I know there's mixed feelings about, like, you know, the whole idea behind Thanksgiving, but I hope you guys can actually, like, take some time off, decompress, chill out a bit. Yeah, Beacon's not doing anything anymore. I am very ready to relax and chill. Same. Like, I wasn't feeling well, so I kind of, so I only, like, I left work a couple hours early on Friday, but... Those were like, I think the last two days after going to the office till later, which is until after the holidays, which is more after Thanksgiving, so that's nice. But yeah, like, y'all, it's like, I am looking forward to just not having to worry about anything. Because even working from home is not. I, I know stress less is not a word, but like. You know, this. And look at them just hovering over it. Fuck this. Nope. Oh, look how she gets to it. Why? Yep. 